Hey guys, this is your weekly forecast for the 12th of March 2018. Now, if you would like a private reading with me, do use the link below. And of course, um, the monthly videos are up. Watch your sun, moon, and rising. So this week, I feel like there's going to be a feverish uh, pitch. There's a lot going on, and there's tensions rising um, also about issues, the past. So in different areas of your life, someone wants to bring up the past, renegotiate past issues or options. This is also about, um, you know, people being at the top of their uh, emotional self, being at the the last straw, you know, fevered uh emotions going on and some of that is in love and others this is about emotional uh, getting to the end of getting to the um, point of no return those kinds of things now in your uh, work study and finances you have the five of pentacles and this is a feeling of loss or a worry about your position due to bad feedback bad reviews uh, or making a mistake some sort of confusion now five is chaos or crisis whether that be big or small now for some of you this is about uh, my health. Uh, you know, I've got a lot of anxiety, I've got a lot of stress, or that I've got a health issue which makes me take time off work so I'm worrying about my position because this is a really uh, poignant time or a crucial time to be at work. Now for others, this is okay, well I need to, I'm the boss and I need to, I've got those that I support, those that are under me, uh, and there's been a uh, drop in numbers or a drop in work or drop in something, or maybe the, you know, the big banking on a project that you thought was going to go through that, that you know it's being stalled or that the um, backing is gone something like that where you feel like um, you, you're feeling the responsibility and the heaviness of that also for others this is about um, the finances so you know you didn't get the yes you got less than you thought you needed but so your resources are less but you're expected to do more for others, this is about I'm collaborating with somebody else and the, the resources aren't the same, the uh, responsibilities, the input, the practical, tangible help. So I feel like I'm carrying someone and this is feeling like a burden for me. In your home, uh, you do have the Ace of Wands, and this is with uh, Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries. So if there's been any issues with uh, arguments, splits, or uh, discord, there is an apology given this week. Uh, also, this is... Um, meeting someone uh, where there's great sexual chemistry um, and it is a yes uh, and it is an offer so whether it be being asked out uh, being made um, girlfriend boyfriend or partner and partner or you know let's move this forward in a positive way and you know share a house you know some sort of next level as well now at home this is about growth at home so you might uh, whether that's expansion, so um, renovating, uh, upsizing, downsizing, um, more people coming into the home. For some people, this is an offer of help, a practical, uh, tangible help, uh, hands-on help. If there's someone that you're caring for in the home and so others are helping, others are offering to help. And this is divinely given. So like I said, if you're at breaking point, uh, there is that success there. This is a, a lovely card of a new cycle, of a new start, a fresh. So for some of you, this is, I've got the yes uh, to lease. I've got the yes to buy. I've um, paid off all my debts and now I'm back at square one. So this is a new cycle around the home. Uh, but specifically for love, uh, this this is about uh, sexual chemistry, this is an apology, uh, this is a fresh cycle there and for those of you that have had any sort of altercation or argument, this is an apology. With your health, you do have the Five of Cups. Now for some of you, this is an addiction issue, this is a crisis point in our addiction, especially drinking, where we have decided, you know, I might want to have a change. Now our Five rules the heart, spine, side of the body and upper back. So like I said in your work, uh, you may have an issue. Uh, where you are some small or large crisis where you have those issues and so your job uh, your your commitment or your responsibility there, there's a bit of um, tension there so if you have to take time off uh, long time off or if there was a sudden crisis at work or work is causing stress which is making these worse your addictions are making these worse that there is um time off work or, or worried about your position at work due to your health. Now this card says that there could be some depression. So you might find that uh, any kind of addiction makes the uh, uh, depression or anxiety worse um, or you might find that this um, heart, spine, side of the body and upper back, uh, that there's a... Um, 
that there's a flow issue or that there's a um, inflammation there's a you know it, it's come to a high for you to be able to get that relief to get that help and for some of you this is about um, ending addictions you know uh, this is a crisis point look you have to make a lifestyle choice for this to be um, successful to get relief from those issues now with your love life you do have the uh, six of wands this is a yes card this is a victory card this is announcements made public uh, it does have mercury retrograde on this so this is from the 9th of March through to the 5th of May um, so you put these two together this could be an offer of marriage and there's a public announcement of this this can be um, you know we're moving on to the next level so we're telling all our friends this is uh, we're getting back together and all our friends know this is uh, uh, there's a uh, baby on the way new cycle we just you know whatever the new is and you're letting that share that with your nearest and dearest and friends so your adoring virtue messages from the angels is So we do have the marriage card and the marriage card uh, will support any of the things I said before about, you know, getting back together, communication, which leads to a positive outcome. Uh, this is about good negotiations uh, and having the right wording for the partnerships to be able to, you know, courage and, and um, faith in being able to make this work now you do have Oceana which is about this fear that we're talking about with our health and with our work that uh, this could be competition this could be your own self sabotage maybe you didn't put the work in maybe you missed a deadline maybe you um, made a big gamble this is saying you are going to rise above that whether it be competition or some sort of bad feedback back to the square um, back to the square one back to the drawing board and refresh renegotiate re look at uh, projects and you know this might actually be good for you because you might find that oh okay the light bulb's on I know exactly where I need to go but this is saying take action with your truth your gut your intuition uh, and that will not fail you now Melina says you know if this is a pregnancy issue or whatever this health um, issue that's causing this you know problem some of you are taking time off work. Some of you are asked to make lifestyle uh, changes. There's an idea of a second opinion. There's an idea of there needs to be more uh, investigational resource. This could this has got a Capricorn over it. This is for some of you an inherited disease from family members. This also was about too much on your plate. So you know it's causing anxiety, stress, and now physical symptoms. So. Um, Listen to the experts and you will find relief. So be kind to you and those you love and I shall see you next week.